everyone welcome to the class welcome to your very own favorite channel a very very good evening to all of you so today we are going to have a lot of fun because today we are not going to study actually we are going to play a game calcu doku so how many of you actually heard about this game hi arnav ankur ashu hi srishti pratiksha good evening hello gungun anvi i am doing good thank you I hope you all are doing fine. I hope you all are excited for today's session. Do you remember we did a session on Sudoku? Remember we played this game and that was a very fun session, honestly. Today we are going to have a lot more fun than than that session. Yes, Rakesh, Archana, Ayushma, Napsara. Thank you, Ankur. Hydra Gamer, Advika, Shristi, perfectly visible and audible. Great, Archana, Sir Covid. Yes, Anukriti. I can see. Yes, I can see that you all are excited. Yes, Sir Covid Raj. Yes. All right, all right. So there is no glitter at all. So we can start. But before I properly start this session, there is an important update. It's regarding the Baidu's mini learning program, which is absolutely free, but it is a limited period offer. And as I say in most of the sessions, that the code that you use to avail this offer is YT free all in caps. How many have actually checked this out? Quickly, tell me. Yes, you can post that in the chat section. And one other thing, in this um, you can get three sessions absolutely free of cost if you use this code. Lot of benefits you are getting here. Two teacher advantages there: one on one guidance from the personal mentor, interactive live classes, yes, and after class assignments and assessments. Best thing is you can choose the class timings at per your convenience and for whatever subject you want to take the class for. No, Dhruvi, you're not late. We have just started. Lots of thumbs up, hearts, and smileys I can see in the chat section. Wow, chocolates too. Yes, Anvi. I hope you are liking it. Quickly, students, share it with your in your school groups as well. I'm sure that they would also love it because today it's going to be a lot of fun. We are going to play a new game, and I hope. Ah, uh, Aishman, try it again. Yes, there was some issue with it, but now it's working fine. Please try it again. Yes, it's amazing. That's great. Hi, Afri, Nadita. I can see a lot many students are now joining. And a lot many new names also I can see here. Yes, Ayushman, that's what I'm saying. After this session, you can try that out. Yoshita. Yes, all right. So I hope everybody has joined the Telegram channel. Yes, for the students who are new here, let me tell you the sessions that we do here. The session PDFs are shared over the Telegram. Some revision questions you get there. Interesting Sunday facts, quizzes, homework questions, and here session updates as well. Yes, it's gonna be fun with learning. We can say that. Ah, uh, Calcu Doku. How many of you have actually heard about it? First of all, tell me. How many of you actually knew about it already? Or oh, this is the first time you are hearing it. Yes, Shubham Bato, Sneha, Advika knows it. Pratiksha, Gungun is is hearing this first time. Sneha, okay, Trishti. So most of Trisha, most of the students, I can see that they are hearing this for the first time. Never heard about this game. Trust me, it's very interesting. It's actually we are doing maths also, but with learning math, we are going to have fun as well. Don't worry. But before I start, I want each one of you to be ready with your notebooks and pens. Yes, this is something which I told you yesterday also. Quickly, be ready with your notebooks and pens because trust me, if you want to solve a puzzle, if you're just watching me doing it, that won't be fun. So let's solve this together. Yes. Quickly, be ready with it. All right, all right. So Calcu Doku, what is it actually? It's basically, I would say, a combination of calculation and Sudoku. Yes, so I would say that Sudoku and math combination it is. It is also known as Kenkan and Kendoku in Japan. Yes, ready, great. Anybody can tell me who invented this? Any idea? That's good, Archana. That's nice. Hi, Uma. See, I still remember the names. Yes, ready, great. Anybody knows who actually invented this? Yes. Japanese, correct, Aditya. So it was invented by a Japanese mathematics teacher, Tatsuya Miyamoto. So in 2003, he actually invented this to help his students improve their mathematical skills, their logical thinking, 
and obviously to have patience also. Because while solving math, generally what happens is we lose patience when we are not able to get to the right answer. It happens, right? And then you're like, okay, I don't like this subject. I can't solve this. That's okay, that's okay, Srishti. I'll tell you the rules before we start with the game. Correct, Apsara. Not me, Papiya. <laughs> so what are the benefits of this of this game, of playing Kalkudoku? First is, when you're bored, I would say, or let's say when you're stressed out, trust me, try playing these kinds of games. Your mind gets distracted. It actually brings a sense of calm and order. And it keeps... It helps your brain to stay healthy. It improves your calculation, your mathematical skills, your logical thinking. And it is fun for all ages. You can do it. Even I can do it. Anybody can solve it. Yes. Are we all ready? Yes. With notebooks and pens. Correct. It enhances maths, aptitude, ability, concentration also it increases. Your focus, your concentration. Yes. It's okay if you don't know how to play this. Most of the people would not know how to play this. Yes? All right. All right. Ready? Yes. Everything is ready. Great. Let's get started. So before we start playing this puzzle, let me tell you the terminology, the rules and all. Absolutely not, Srishti. All right. Let's start this. So here, Kalku Doku terminology, if I talk about it, there are three cross three puzzles, right? 3 cross 3, by that I mean that 3 rows, 3 columns would be there. There are 4 cross 4, 5 cross 5 as well and more than that also. But that's going to be very complicated. So here we have took an example of 4 cross 4 puzzles. I will go very slow when I'm explaining the rules. Okay, so that you all can understand this better. And you can just, and you can just post in the chat section if you have any doubt at any of these steps. Yes? Okay. Yes, Jyotsna is now joined. Okay. Yes, it is interesting. Trust me. So, 4 cross 4 puzzle. We are taking this example. 4 cross 4 means 4 rows you would see and 4 columns. Like you can see here. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 rows. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 columns, right? This says 4 cross 4. Understood? 4 rows, 4 columns. Now, this is same like we did in Sudoku, right? No number over here. Each row of four squares must contain the numbers from one through four. You can only take numbers one, two, three, four. Only these numbers. You cannot take zero. You cannot take five, six, seven, eight, nine. Only one, two, three, and four. These are the numbers which we have to use to fill these. Clear? That's what Josephine, I was just thinking actually in my mind, in the back of my mind that this is, I think that's, that's not your real name. Okay. Similar to Sudoku, so what is the difference then? What is the difference between this and Sudoku? Let's see that. And each column also will have only numbers 1, 2, 3, 4. You cannot pick any other numbers. Keep jotting down the important points that I'm saying, right? It will be easier for you when you're solving the puzzle. Because I'll be asking you questions while I'm solving, okay? All right. So, we can pick only four numbers 1, 2, 3, 4. Now, another thing is no number should be repeated. You cannot repeat any number in the same column in the same row. Write this point. We cannot repeat the numbers. Yes, please write that down. That's good, Aishman. Okay. All right. Now, here, what is the difference? In Sudoku, we were talking about boxes that has got cells. Here, we have cages. If you see, cages are basically, you, if you observe the puzzle pieces with, with thick borders, you can see this border is thick. This is a cage. This cage has two cells. Look at another cage. I'm using a different color to show you. This is another cage with thick borders. It has got two cells. Look at this cage. This cage has only one cell. If this is fun. But first we have to focus on understanding the rules. After that it will be a lot of fun. Trust me. Your mind will be completely distracted. You won't be able to think about anything else. Okay. So here look at this cell. I mean this cage. This has got two cells. It's not always, no Apsara, that's what I'm trying to say. It's not always, uh, don't make it a rule that every cage will have two cells. No, it's not like that. Like if you look at this, this cage, this cage has only one cell. Look at this thicker boundary. Okay, let me use another color. That's why I was thinking maybe red might not be visible. Look at this, this has a thicker boundary, only one cell is here, right? Look at this cell, this has two cells. It depends, you have to check how many cells each cage has got. Look at the thick borders. 
Yes, please note this down because while solving the puzzle, you will get confused otherwise. Yes. No, no, no. I just want you so that you can also relax your mind. Yes, correct. Focus on thick boundaries. Hey, Rekha, you have just joined. Yes. So I'm just repeating the rules one more time. The students who have now joined, you can only pick four numbers for this. Let me use different color. Only four numbers. That is one, two, three and four. No other number you can use. In any row or column, you cannot repeat the numbers. Look at the thick boundaries. They are representing the cages. This much part is clear. Yes, Diksha, I hope yellow is visible now. Yellow is visible, right? Yellow is visible. Yes. Cage, cage, aisa nahi lag raha. Agreed. That's why we have to learn their terminology first. Last cage has only... Last cage. This is a cage. All four boundaries. All four boundaries you have to consider. This has got two cells. Correct? Okay. This color is better. Great. This... Okay. Now, while filling these, these cells, you have to keep one thing in mind. There would be numbers written. Some hints would be given. So, keeping those conditions in mind, we have to fill this. It's okay, Rekha. Like what I'm trying to say here is, like here, you can see over here, in the first cage, we have 3 plus. What this 3 plus means? Plus means, plus is the operator. Addition is the operator. You can only add numbers. Two numbers that you are going to pick up. Because here in this cage, you have to fill two numbers. Those two numbers can be only out of 1, 2, 3 and 4. You cannot pick any other number. Out of these four numbers, I have to pick two numbers such that on adding them, I get 3. That's very simple. It's going to be 1 or 2 or 2 or 1. Correct? Only one combination is possible. First tell me if this much part is clear. Then I'll move ahead. Yes. Brinda is saying clear. Quickly, fast. Thumbs up, smileys. Yes, Rishti. I can see thumbs up. Gungun, crystal clear. Pratiksha. Yes. All right, all right. Yes, Advika, Dhruvi. Clear. Yashita, Apsara, Prabodha, Sir Kovid, Sveta. Yes, hints would be given, right? Hydra Gamer, Hydra Gamer. So, 3 plus is here. That means you need number 3. And you can pick only 2 numbers from here because in these 2 cells, we can fill only 2 numbers. Only 2 numbers. This cage consists of 2 cells. I can pick only 2 numbers. We have to add them up so that I get 3. Now, doubt part. What shall I write here? Well, I should I write one here, two here? Or should I write two here, one here? That's the confusion here. And this is the most interesting part, trust me. Yes, Uma? Uma, Srishti, Shubhan, Vito, Rekha, quickly. Yes, please post whatever doubt you have. Why? You can do that. Link is in the description for that, Ashu, but... Please try that out after the session. Right now, let's focus on the rules first. Let's try, have let's have some fun with these puzzles. Puppy, I think this is the same question which you asked me in the Sudoku session as well. Right? Alright. Let's take some more examples. You will be able to understand better. Now look at this. This is our puzzle. Okay. Let me explain you the rules first. This is 3 plus. So you understood that we can only pick numbers out of 1, 2, 3, 4. We have to put two numbers over here and operator is addition. So that when I add them, I get three. Yes, I'm explaining now the entire puzzle. Then we will solve this together. Here I have got seven plus. Seven plus means out of one, two, three, four, I can pick only two numbers to fill here. What those two numbers be? An operator is addition. What two numbers will you pick? Quickly first tell me. Shravani. Okay. All right. Okay, in Sudoku, you ask this. Oh, you was the recorded one. Hint is given. Okay, Shravani. Hint is given for the entire cage. For the entire cage and at times for a cell also it would be given. 3, 4. Why is with a Why 1, 2? Gungun, how come 6, 1? You cannot, you can only pick numbers from 1, 2, 3, 4. You cannot take 6, 1. Yes. Only 1, 2, 3, 4. It's okay, Shrikant. Even if you don't know Sudoku, that's fine. It's a different game. Yes, for 3, the possibilities are 1 and 2. I don't know 1 plus 2 or 2 plus 1. For 7, the possibilities are 3 and 4. Yes, Brinda, why are you writing 7 and 4? Yes, Dhruvi, you are right. Ankur, Trisha, absolutely. 
Okay, for six, what are the possibilities? Let's first talk about the possibilities. Then we will move ahead. Yes, Trishti, you are right. Papi, I'll come to that. I'll come to that. We cannot repeat numbers in the same row or in the same column. We cannot repeat. Yes, Ayushman, please post that. For six, yes, absolutely. For six, it's going to be four and two. It's going to be four and two. For four, is it? it's going to be what? Quickly, for four. I will not tell you the answer. First, you tell me. See, we are having a discussion first over the over the rules, right? Yes, Shravani. Shravani, only four numbers you have. One, two, three, four. These are only, I have given you only four numbers. I am asking you, how will you get four plus? That means the operator is addition. You need two numbers such that when you add them, you get four. Sweta, yes. Sweta is asking, can we repeat numbers? We cannot repeat numbers in the same row or the same column. Correct. Three plus one, right, Trisha? 3 plus 1 or 1 plus 3? I don't know what it is going to be. Yes, 1 and 3. You all are right. Brinda, not 2 plus 2. Pick different numbers. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's use red then. Talking about this 6. 6 is again, it's going to be what? 2 and 4 because 2 cells I can see this way. No, these are the simple rules. Let's try solving this now. First, you see how am I sol how I am solving this. Now, you were asking me, ma'am, what about the numbers which are written this way, with no operator with them? Which are just written single numbers. No operator is written. What does that mean? That's very simple. You just have to write the same, the number as it is in that cell. 3. As it is, I'm going to write the numbers because they have got no operators. Yes? Intelligent, Papiya. Right? This step is clear. When no operator is there, we just have to put the exact number in the cell. No surrender saying. I just saw your comment. This is easy. Correct? Rules are clear? Quickly first give me thumbs up smileys if you are clear with the rules. Then we can start solving the puzzle. Uh, we cannot straight away. Ayushman, if we add 3 plus 4 and 7 comes, I cannot write 7. Because I will tell you this thing. How we are filling up the filling the boxes here. I can see lots of, it's okay Surendra, now we will be discussing this. Okay, I can see lots of thumbs up and, and smileys here. Now we are already clear that these two numbers are fixed. We are done with two numbers. We are sure that 3, 3 will come here. This is for sure. I give you a hint, uh, like how to solve these puzzles. Try solving with the, start with the bigger ones. Generally, it makes it easier for us, you know, to go ahead. Okay, I'll use yellow or black color. I mean, black or red color in the boxes. Fine. Now, this is 7. Okay, and you can see that in this cage. Look at this cage. In this cage, we have got two cells. What two numbers I can pick so that I can form 7? What two numbers? I can only use numbers from, we all know this, 1, 2, 3, 4. You cannot pick any other number. Yes, what two numbers we can pick here? Quickly. 3 and 4. Okay. Shall I write 3, 4 or I write 4, 3? Yes. 3, 4 or 4, 3. Here comes the confusion part. I tell you one thing. I told you you cannot repeat the numbers in any row or any column. Look at this column. This last column. Look at this one. This already has got 3. That means here 3 cannot come. 3 cannot come in the same column. Make sense? Yes. Correct, sir, COVID. 3 and 4. So, 4 will come here and 3 will come here. So, this way we can complete this entire cage. 3 plus 4 is 7. First, tell me if this step is clear. Quickly. Aditya already solved. Wow. Intelligent. Very smart. Yes, 4 and 3 is not right because it is not following the rules. This is clear. Yet, yeah, make sense? Okay. So, so, once this step is clear, just give me thumbs up, okay? So that we know, I know that I can move to the next step. Okay. Clear. Now, move. let's move ahead. Let's see here. If I talk about this 6, this way we can pick up any number. See, it's not a hard or fast rule. It can't be repeated in any row, any column. Just remember this thing. We cannot repeat numbers in any row or any column. 6 is only possible with 2 and 4. Right? It's only possible with 2 and 4. So I know that in this cage, 2 and 4 will come. But in what order, that I don't know. Correct? Correct. I don't know whether 2, 4 or 4, 2. Oh God, Sneha. So many smileys, thumbs up. 
Yes. Okay. Two and four, we don't know the order. Moving to this five. Five. Can you tell me the combinations for five? Five plus. Yes. Tell me the combinations for five. Five is possible. Five is possible with two combinations. I can take, I can take two, three also. I can take one and four also. Which can I use here? I tell you one thing. See, three is already here. If I write two, three, three cannot come. As I said, two same numbers cannot come in the same row. Right? I cannot pick this. Or if you ask him, ma'am, you can write it this way also. You write 3, 2. That is also not possible. Here, two threes are coming together. That means definitely I cannot use this pair over here. I cannot use 2, 3. This is not possible. That's easy. Very nice, Dhruvi. Now, 1 and 4 is the only option I have got. How should I write it? Should I write 1 here, 4 here or 4 here, 1 here? What do I do? Now, remember one thing. 6 is only can 6 can only be made using the pairs 2 and 4 so definitely in this case 4 will definitely come 4 will definitely come in the bottom row so definitely i cannot write 4 over here 4 cannot come here so i'll write 1 over here and 4 over here in that case tell me if this is clear i hope the the reason is clear why i cannot write 4 in the bottom row no, this is confusing. 4, 1, 1, 4. I don't know how you are actually actually writing it. You are assuming the uh, it, it columns according to the column or rows. Great. Lots of thumbs up. Yes. Clear. All right. Burger cheesy. Now, this is very popular. Easy peasy something dot dot dot. Yes. All right. So, Swetha, as I said, 6 is possible with 2, 4. Right? So definitely 2 here, 4 here or 4 here, 2 here. 4 is already in the last row. We cannot repeat the number. That's why I have written 4, 1. Right? I cannot take 4 in the bottom row. Now, here we have 1. Let's move ahead. This is 3. Now this will become very simple. This is 3. This is 4. This is 1. As we know that we only have 4 numbers. 1, 2, 3 and 4. What is left here? 2. Let's write down 2 without thinking anything. Correct? Okay, moving to this, 3 plus, 3 plus, 3 plus is possible with what pair? 1 and 2. I cannot write, I cannot write 2, 1, why? Because 2, 2's cannot come together in the same row. Yes, I cannot write 2 over here. So, over here I will write 1, here 2. Tell me if this is clear. Wow, Aditya, amazing, done with it. Great. Yes, 1, 2. Navya, okay. Here, Shravani, Shristi, Ayushman, Prabodha, Advika, Shubhan, Vito, clear. Great. We have 3, we have 4, we have 2. What is left? 1. Let's simply write this. 1 over here. Now, I know that this is 4. This cage, this is an entire cage you can see. 4 can be formed with? 3 and 1. Definitely 3 will come here. Correct. 3 will come here. Okay. Now, I have to form this. This is 3. This is 2. This is 1. What is left? Simply, I can write 4 over here. This is also done. Correct. Okay. Now, what do I have here? We have 6. 6 is what? 6 is 2 and 4. I cannot write 2 and 4 because 4 is here. 4 is here. Same number can is not possible in the same column. So, what will I do? Let's exchange this. I'll write 2 here and 4 over here. Correct? Yes, after filling a few numbers, it becomes very simple. You just have to see whatever is left. This is 3, 1, 4. So, 2 will come here and 1 will come here. Bingo! Yes? 2, 1, 3, 4, 3, 4, 2, 1, 1, 3, 4, 2, 4, 2, 1, 3. It's very simple and easy, right? All done. Everybody is done with it. Yes, this is clear. Great, Ankur. Not, I'm not able to understand your name, Shrikant. Yes? Clear. Let's try out one more puzzle. This time I will not help you. First you try this out. I'll give you a few seconds. I'm not saying that you do the entire puzzle. Just tell me for a few of them. Hi, you monk. It's fun, right? You're enjoying it? Great. 
So now this is the puzzle for you. In the first previous one, I helped you a lot, right? That we solved together. Now you tell me, where should I start from? Quickly observe this puzzle. Yes. Uh, we That's the rule, Papiya. We cannot take negative numbers. We can only take these positive numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4. Nitya Shri. Okay. All right. Tell me one thing. Why are you not using the same names? Why different names? Because it becomes difficult for me to remember all of your, I mean, your real names. Yes. Swayam. Okay. From Maharashtra. Great. You are saying from 24 because as I said, start from the bigger ones. Great. But can you see this number over here without any operator? Let's fix this place. So we have one number for sure over here. 24, bigger number. Okay, let's split that first. Did you did you observe the cage this time? Did you observe the cage here? Cage is this part. Somebody asked me this question when I was explaining the rules. Ma'am, cage will always contain two cells. See, it's not like that. This time this cage is in L shape. Look at the boundaries, the thick boundaries. This has got three cells. Yes? It's a nice name. Three, yes, three cells are there. So, this time I need to pick three numbers, but out of one, two, three, four only. Yes? So, what is the combination? Quickly, you tell me. Three numbers, that gives you 24. Operator is multiplication this time. This is going to be tricky now. Operator is multiplication. Three cells. Yes, Trishti. Quickly, I want answers. Let me see who can answer first. Rinda. Yes. Four, three, two. Correct. 4 times 3 times 2 is the possibility. But I don't know which in which order should I write it. Yes, this is a complex one. Correct. In which order? Shall I write? Okay, let's try this out. Shall I write 4 here, 3 here, 2 here? Or should I write 2 here, 4 here, 3 here? Or should I? Like, a lot of combinations are possible. What should I do? I don't know that. Let's keep it aside. Let's keep it aside. Let's write here that this is the, this is the combination. 4, 3 and 2. Okay. Now, Look at this one, this 3A over here. This is also L-shaped cage, correct? Three numbers. How am I going to get three? Three is only possible if we have one times three times one. But if, if you remember, I told you the rule, you cannot repeat numbers in the same column or the same row. So I can write it this way. One, three, one. Make sense? It's okay, Palak. That's fine. You can watch it after the session. Yes, permutations and combinations. Yes. Don't you think that these puzzles that we are solving here, it's actually, you know, it actually helps you to get, escape from the boredom or it actually distracts your mind. Yes, no spamming, please. It's interesting, right? Correct. I hope this cell is clear. One, three, one. This is clear because I cannot write it this way. 1, 1, 3. As I said, same numbers cannot come in the same column. I cannot write it like this. 3, 1, 1. That is not. So this is the only combination possible. 1, 3, 1. Places are fixed. Yes? Completed. Wow, Ashu. You kept it like this only. Nitya Shri. I am not repeating. No, no, no. I wrote 1, 3, 1. Yes? This time it's a it's a cell. It's a cage containing three cells. Crystal clear. Okay. Moving to this one. Six. Six has got two cells. An operator is plus. That is simple. Possibility is two and four. But what shall I write? Shall I write two here, four here? Two, four, four, two. That I don't know. Wow. Ayushman. Some people are done with it. Great. So one thing we can say that. If 6 is 2 and 4, so definitely 4 will come in this row. Definitely it will come. Or 2 will also come. So definitely 1 is here, 2 will come, 4 will come. So this place should be fixed with 3. Correct? Make sense? Yes? Because I don't know 2 will come here, 4 will come here or 4 here, 2 here. But I know that 1 is fixed. Definitely in these two cells, 4 and 2 would be there. Correct? So that's why I can say that 3 will come here. Quickly, if you have understood, give me thumbs up, smileys, so that, so that I can understand. And I can move to the next step. Vrinda says clear, gungun, yes. 
सुरेंदर सिंह नव्या राइट कंप्लीटेड ध्रुवी वाओ ग्रेट ऑसम आई कैन सी दैट एवरीबडी हैज अंडरस्टूड वाओ आयुषी क्लियर प्रबोधा नित्याश्री कंप्लीटेड क्लियर ग्रेट ओके सो दिस इज टू इयर लेट्स फिक्स दिस नाउ लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट दिस एंड दिस नंबर्स ओवर हियर एट हैज द पॉसिबिलिटी मल्टीप्लिकेशन इज द ऑपरेटर टू एंड फोर राइट फोर हैज टू पॉसिबिलिटीज आइदर आई कैन टेक वन वन फोर वन टाइम्स वन टाइम्स फोर और आई कैन टेक टू टाइम्स टू टाइम्स वन दैट विल ऑल्सो गिव मी फोर नाउ लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस दैट्स द मोस्ट इंटरेस्टिंग पार्ट इफ आई फिक्स टू ओवर हियर yes and 4 over here and i pick this pair that is 2 2 1 not possible two same numbers cannot come in the same column and two numbers are coming in the same row also that is not possible or if i write it this way 1 2 2 still not possible still two numbers are coming together two same numbers that's not possible that means this possibility 2 2 1 it is not possible we can only go ahead with 1 1 4 so let's use that 1 4 1 okay now Eight over here is two four. Why? Because four is coming here, so definitely I cannot use four over here. I'll have to write four here and two here. Make sense? This is clear. Any doubt still here? Quickly. Yes, Rishti, Papiya, Gungun. Yes, clear. Prabodha. Everybody is solving. It looks like yes. Pratiksha. Doubt. Ashrita. Pratiksha. Okay, let me explain it one more time. When I'm saying eight is only two times four, yes, eight is two times four, and for this four times four multiplier, we have two options: one times one times four, two times two times one. Now let's suppose I don't know the answer yet. Okay, so let's suppose if I fix, if I fix two over here, if I fix two over here, four over here, two four, and if I use this pair two two one, is this possible? First, tell me. Can I use two two one? Hmm. Okay. Even if you say two one two, let me write this. Two one two. Is this possible? Yes. Because two numbers are coming in the same row. Same numbers. No. Right. So that means definitely this pair is not possible. Two two one. Right. Okay. So let's do one thing. Let's go with one one four. I can write one four four. Whenever you have this L shape, this is the right way to write it, so that two same numbers do not come together. Correct. So four is here, one is here, three is here. Other number would be two. So here I'll have four because I need four times two. That is eight. Make sense? Yes, Shravani, you're right. Okay. Now this is solved. This much part is solved. Now let's do one thing. Let's move to the next one. So three is here, one is here, four is here. What is left? Two is left here. Correct. Let's fill two here. This is one cell. This entire is one cell. L shape. What did you say? To get twenty four multiply, we need four, three, and two. Three is here. Two is here. So four will come here. Any doubts? Shravani solved. Yes, Pratiksha. Right. Simple than Sudoku. Much more interesting than Sudoku. Yes. Agreed. Shristi, why are you confused? This is simple. No doubt. Shubhan Vito, yes, completed. Prabodha, Ashu, Ashrita, still solving. It's okay. Take your time. Now, let's move to the next one. So here we have six plus two four four two. Four is already here. So obviously two will come here. Then four will come here. Okay. This is okay. This is two. This is two. This is four. So definitely three will come here. If three is here, so what this number is going to be? This is going to be two. So we have three, two, four, one, two, four, one, three, one, three, two, four, four, one, three, two, and we are done with it. Yay! Interesting. Yes, completed. Wow. Some of you completed before I started solving this, right? Are you sure, Crystal Clear? Quickly, give me thumbs up, smileys, if you have understood this. Yes. Oh, interesting! Woo hoo! Yes, yes, Ayushman, I know that you solved it few minutes back. Completed. Great, Hemlata, Shristi. What do you think? Sudoku is more interesting or Calcu Doku? I find Calcu Doku more interesting than Sudoku. Absolutely, Sonam. Yes, you can. 
And if you are liking these puzzles, if you are liking this session, quickly hit the like button. Interesting, right? Kalkudoku. Suryansh. I can see that everybody is saying Kalkudoku. Even I find Kalkudoku more interesting. So, do you also feel that it actually helps you, you know, in, in distracting your mind and you enhancing your mathematical skills, your logical skills also? My vote as well. I'll also count my vote here. You want more questions like this? Don't worry, we have more questions. I cannot leave you without a homework question. So this is the puzzle that you can try out after this session and you can let us know in the comment section that were you able to solve it or not. But yes, I will be coming and I'll show you the solution. I'll be discussing the solution of this puzzle. Yes? Yes, it helps in increasing the logical skills, correct? So do try this out and then we will discuss the solution of this puzzle. All right, all right. And just to remind you that the link for this is given in the description. Do not forget to use the code YT3 all in caps to avail the offer. Thank you, Navya. All right, all right. And don't worry, we have got you covered. So many sessions we have for you from every Monday to Friday to make you exam ready. And you can see from the type of sessions that we are coming up here with, right? Not only the we are covering the syllabus, but we are working on the other things as well, right? So that to enhance your mathematical skills, that is also important. And please like, share and subscribe if you feel that these sessions are helpful. Share in your school groups with your friends. Thank you, Ankur, Prabodha, everybody. Thanks a lot. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.